Fox is a Taylor GC7 guitar and my single favorite object in the world. That is not to say that I don't love Yol, Sox, Ghost, Booger, or Bomb, but I do have a special connection with Fox. She's fun to play and enables me to make money doing what I love. She's the guitar I decided to buy after Ghost was destroyed. I told myself my next guitar would be the last guitar I'd ever need to buy, so I bit the bullet, spent quite a bit of money, and got exactly what I wanted. Fox, or Foxy Lady, is extremely well-made and easily my favorite guitar in the world, ever. She's a grand concert-style acoustic guitar with a rosewood fretboard and an unusual classical-style headstock, more body than the more common dreadnought, and has a higher, more delicate sound. Being smaller does not hold her back, though. I am notoriously heavy-handed when strumming, so me and Fox are capable of making plenty of noise without needing a larger resonance chamber, like those of a dreadnought. Fox makes playing more enjoyable for me because of her playability and the dynamic range I can get out of her. It is also with her that I'm able to actually make money doing what I love. Most of Fox's days are spent in her case. There I know she is safe until I have need for her. There are only three reasons I take Fox out of her protective cocoon. To practice, for a gig, or to change her strings. I wanted to add a fourth reason, pleasure, but every time I play, it's a pleasure. When practicing, I usually sit in my dining room for the acoustics and play whatever comes to mind for about a half hour. I then look up songs I've been thinking of covering and just wing it. I don't normally put a ton of thought into the covering songs. If it feels good, I'll do it. If it doesn't, I won't waste my time. During a gig is when she shines the most. Fox's quiet nature and my loud playing style enable us to have a great amount of expression. She can be gentle and quiet or loud and roaring. This dynamic range is a huge advantage when performing stripped down versions of songs, and it really helps put emotion into the tune. Oddly enough, changing Fox's strings is when I feel the most connected to her. I get a chance to look over her whole body, see every ding and scratch, and clean her thoroughly. I'm always surprised how fresh, new, and good she feels after a cleaning and a string change. Because just moments before, I couldn't imagine her sounding better. Purchasing Fox, a carefully constructed amalgamation of wood and metal, is one of the best decisions I have ever made. She has given me hours of joy and self-expression and is an integral part to my continued success as a musician. Fox's days are usually pretty boring, but I like to think she's just saving her energy for when she performs. Mm -hmm.